All right, in a nutshell, here's the story of my New Zealand stag. My wife said, you're going to New Zealand to go deer hunting? You can go deer hunting right out the back here. But I'm coming from the east coast of the United States. I came about as far as you can go on the earth to go deer hunting, and here's why. I think all deer hunters understand what I'm talking about right now. Uh, my guide, John Ellum, and I, and uh, my partners from uh, Browning, Browning Ammunition, uh, we hunted hard all week, and uh, I was the slow one in the group. Uh, today we kind of mixed things up, and my buddy Brett Floyer from Winchester and Browning Ammunition came along, and uh, we were probably getting pretty close to knocking off for lunch, and Brett spotted this guy under a tree, and I won't even tell you how close we were. It's almost embarrassing. Uh, but uh, we figured we couldn't do anything right then or he would bolt on out. So we, we got away from him. We put a big cir circle stalk on so we could get up on a ridge uh, over on the other side of a gully from where he was bedded down. It was uh, just the perfect positioning and then it gave me a nice easy shot. I was using the Browning uh, X-Bolt Hell's Canyon Speed Rifle. I was using Browning ammunition with the BXC bullet, a 180 grain out of a 30 odd six. You know, people sometimes knock the 30 odd six. We're in the age of magnums now, but you can still get the job done on big animals like this. It's been a magnificent hunt. I, I'm i glad that I didn't listen to my wife in this case. I will all the rest of the time. I came halfway around the world because I'm a deer hunter and a deer hunter, uh, you can't beat this.